Well, welcome to my channel. I'm Melissa and okay today I have a couple products that I wanted to talk to you about. I've already have tried them. I'm not going to try them in this video. I'm just going to talk to you about them um, because I don't know. I just feel like everybody knows how to put on you know a primer and um, I will use I okay so let me just tell you what I'm gonna try so today we're trying out the new um, Urban Decay face primer um, it's the all-nighter face primer primer long wear foundation grip it pre um, preps smooths perfects and it is um, supposed to um, like help keep you matte before we get started and get talking about this, um, before I give you my thoughts, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, please. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you very much. And also feel free in the comments to let me know what you want me to try, what you want to, um, you know, what you've been thinking about purchasing and you, you know, you don't really want to, you want me to buy it first and try it out. Let me know and I will do that. Okay. So this is, like I said, the Urban Decay primer and it is $36 and like I said it's supposed to like grip your foundation okay so if any of you have tried like the makeup forever like the step one step two so like I have uh step one and then this one is the mattifying base um so now I feel like that kind of felt like that after first so it feels moisturizing I will show you and so it comes in this little tube and you get 30 mls, that's one fluid ounce. Um, it has a little pump. It looks like a cream and it feels like a cream at first and it feels really moisturizing but then you can feel that it like dries and it almost gets like tacky when you move you know over it um which is like a good thing you think that it's going to grip your makeup and keep it um i don't feel like it's made my makeup last longer um or less oily um because i wear my foundation gosh hours i pro i put my start my makeup about 5 30 in the morning and then wear it all day until probably seven o'clock um sometimes later sometimes earlier but i mean i'm wearing my makeup for a long period sometimes eight it just depends on what i'm doing but so feel i did wear this for a couple days and that's why i just wanted to talk to you about it because i actually have worn it and have tried it for a few days and it i don't think i mean sometimes with primers like this i feel like I will break out like that Makeup Forever one. I will start breaking out around on like on my nose and on the sides of my nose. And this started to do the same. So um, I had a couple little breakouts on my nose every night after wearing it. But I mean, I've been wearing my I wear my makeup for such a long time. So, but it is something that's kind of, it feels like it's clogging my pores. It just feels a little bit thicker than normal. Um, I really think not wearing a primer helps with my oily skin. I mean, I feel like that does. If I just wear mattifying foundation, it really helps. I don't know why I'm like out of breath. Um, or I use the Tatcha Satin Skin Mist. This, I feel like if you use this after your moisturizer, before your foundation, you spray it in and kind of like press on your face I feel like this helps your makeup and helps it last and you will look like kind of matte after you apply like all your makeup at first for just a little bit until your like oils start coming through and then it just looks so beautiful so I mean but this I really feel like is a long lasting I'm like down to here on it I love this stuff okay so this like I said I for $36, I don't think it is something that I'm going to like keep using. I don't think it worked, and like I said, I'm breaking out around my nose. So now, um, the next thing is the Urban Decay All Nighter Ultra Matte Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray, and everybody loves the original 
all-nighter setting spray. Um, the original is something that I do use on brides because it does help um, their makeup last longer. I, I, I mean, it's not something that I use personally every day, but um, they came out with this ultra matte and it looks like this and it is $33 and it is four ounces. Um, and it says up to 16 hour wear lightweight temperature control technology. So um, I didn't use it today, so I'll spray it on my face right now so you can see. Uh, I used it the other day and I don't know if I like didn't shake it up or whatever, but I kind of had like white little specks all over my face. I don't know if like, I mean that's happening or if like my sprayer, something's wrong with the actual pump, but let's try it. All right. It has like a fine mist, but okay, so right there, you can see that it is white. I don't know if that's the powder or something like whatever the technology is in this that makes you matte is what was all over my face. It looked like little milk splatters all over. Um, and I mean, this one is white too. So, I mean, I think it's just something maybe you should shake up. Um, I should probably do like this versus this. Maybe I will try that. Um, but today I'm just going to use this. Okay, let me just cover my eyes. Okay. Oh. Okay, now I'm just going to press it in um, because... So what I do with the Tatcha after as well, I kind of press it in. And, oh, so also one thing I did notice, and I didn't say it with this, with the primer. So after I put the primer on and then like I go in with my foundation, I, after my foundation, you know, when I'm doing my concealer or something, I feel like a tightening and... I mean, which is a good thing. Maybe like your pores are tightening and like, you know, that kind of stuff. But, um, and then I do look pretty dry, um, pretty matte. But for those of you, you know, that aren't oily and that are dry, you probably won't like that about this primer because it does feel like you're like getting, the moisture is getting like sucked out of you, which is a really weird thing. Um, and actually it feels like that right now too. So... I'm gonna spray a little more on my chin. And so now I've tried this spray along with the primer. Um, but also midday I did go and spray my face with this and uh, I felt like it kind of made my oils disappear again. So which the Tatcha does. If you do this midday to your face, again, I feel like you just look like you just did your makeup again. Um, because that is really what, I don't know what that is in there, but it is amazing. So anyways, but this, I did feel like it helped with my oil, oils. So I think if you're going to do, you know, like choose one or the other, um, probably go with this because you can use this before your foundation as well. And it would help. Um, I mean, and this is if you're oily. If you're oily like me, like definitely, you know, probably stay away from that. Stick with this. Do this before your foundation and after your makeup application. I think you'll be good. So that's it for the video. Thank you for watching. I uh, hope you got some information. I hope it was helpful and useful um, so you can make your own decision um, on whether or not to go and buy these products. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, please. And I'll see you next time. Bye.